It is Toronto's version of March Madness, yeah. really, isn't it? Yeah, everybody <laughs> getting ready to register for the City of Toronto Spring Program and Summer Camps. It is just days away, and today we are going to help you with tips of the best chance of getting your child into the program that they're like, please, Mom, please, Dad, please, 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 please. Howie Dayton from Parks Forestry and Recreation, thank you so much for giving us all of your wisdom this morning. Good morning. Good morning. Happy to be here. Now we're going to share that wisdom. Yes. 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 What, uh, the, it, and it's a bit confusing because different parts of the city, for the old cities, have different registration dates. That's right. right. And it's just to try and help uh, parcel it out. But uh, this Saturday, we start with our uh, Topical York registration. Sunday is uh, Scarborough. Tuesday, North York, where you'll be registering. Yes. And then uh, we've got Wednesday, East uh, Toronto, East York, and West Toronto, York. So 7 a.m. starts for all of those dates. Um, is uh, sort of how we break it out. And can you, re sorry, I just want to, can you register anywhere in the city for any of the programs, you or do you have to be in those regions? No, no, you can register anywhere, but the programs uh, in those districts are only available starting on those registration dates. That makes sense. Right. Okay, now you need to equip yourself so you don't just sit right. in front of a monitor and, and cross your fingers. There are ways that you can speed up the process, right? That's so right. So what, what is your number one tip? Prepare. Be planned. So go on toronto.ca slash fun, look through all of our program offerings, have your choices, have your family account ready, have your barcodes for all of the programs, have choices. So if you don't get into your first choice, you have a second and third choice for all of the participants and yourself. And then you're ready to go at 7 a.m. with your wish list and you just bang, bang, bang through the programs that you want to register for. And when you say the bar, what do you mean bar, like how do you have them ready? So every program has a specific code. And so if you look in our fund guide, you see I want this program and this day, this time. It has a code, that's a registration code. And you can create an online wish list so that you would just enter in that code into our registration site and if there's space available you'll be registered automatically so you've seen some people who are online then they they're on the phone too and then they have someone in line <coughs> with a spouse or whatnot is standing what is the, your best chance of getting into a program is it online yeah so we have made significant improvements to our online system our search tools and our registration site 96 percent are now registering online and we've really reduced uh, through those investments the amount of time it takes to register down to an average wait time of five minutes and an average uh, registration period of 10 minutes to go through the session. So I really do recommend the online experience as being a better one to give you the most chance for success. How many people try and sign up? Any idea? It's, it's thousands of spaces. We have 600,000 recreation spaces across the city with council's approval of our growth plan. We're adding another 15,000 this year. So there's a lot of demand for recreation. This is our biggest registration period. It's spring programs, spring aquatics, and summer camp. So we have a couple of hundred thousand registration spaces that will be registering over these four dates. This is going to be a big one. And so uh, we also have some tips when it comes to when you're sitting online on your computer, not to leave it idling, not to walk away from it. What, what should you or should you not be doing here? Well, I wouldn't leave it alone. Yeah. So there's there's <laughs> ways to refresh that are, are if you're not getting a session right away. So stay with it. Um, and uh, hopefully you get a session pretty quickly. As I said, the wait times have been significantly reduced for people. And yeah. if you do get into a program, will it hold it for you if you have any kind of issues or you're... Uh, well, there's a time out. Yeah. Uh, I, you know, if you're not, if you don't have uh, your credit card information ready, it may time out. So have all of that payment information ready. Just be totally organized. And, and we have all of the steps you need to take. I would really recommend reading through that. If you're not sure, we've also extended our client service hours this week, so we can help you prepare, we can help you get your family account ready, um, and any questions you have on how to maneuver the system, this is the week to get those questions answered. We were laughing earlier because I <coughs> never usually get my son into the, his top choice because I'm on air at 7 a.m., right? So um, we may be trying it next week, right? Oh, yeah, you can help great. Me. Oh, yeah, yeah, fine. Okay. For you, I'll we'll, give you a we'll break. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Time. All right. All right. We'll have a little time. All right, I'll be watching. I'll be watching. Is, what, what, uh, what's your favorite? Do you have a favorite program? So I went to Camp New York in North York. So it's a camp that's over 60 years old. I love the nature camps, and I think it's just a great opportunity to give kids a chance to experience nature in the city, horseback riding, orienteering, overnights. Uh, so those are my personal favorite. But we have so many choices for Love everybody. It. Beautiful. So there's the dates again in case you missed it. And the website to go to? Toronto.ca slash fun. Good stuff. Perfect. Howie, thank, thank you very, you very much. much.